Hello everyone, MP Hater here. Welcome back to my Let's Play slash walkthrough prep for Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Liberty. In the last episode, we began the game. We ended up beating the first boss, Olga Grulukovic, who's kind of a tutorial boss, almost, to say. And we're about to progress into the rest of the game. Uh, I will say that I have since turned on some mods as I didn't realize that the mods themselves weren't working in the last episode, but they're supposed to make the game look uh, even better and fix a few of the quirks in the game as well. So we're going to head around here. Worth mentioning, by the way, I'm not going to have my camera on for this session. My allergies are really awful, and I look really awful because of them, so maybe in a couple of days. So we got thermal goggles, these will help us like they did in Metal Gear Solid 1. So I happen to like these a lot better than the other goggles. And we now have a UPS, which allows us to hold up enemies that, um, that act like they're a little bit more, you know, special. <laughs> Though we don't have any ammo, so we got to be careful. Well, problem solved. You got ammo. If you hold up an enemy and you don't have ammo, if you try to shoot, they'll immediately pull out their gun. So. Forgot the US USB is loud, very, very loud. come anyway, but at least at least they're going to be a little late.
So back to this room. I guess we can just stay here. Go around. Uh oh. Hey, more US people. It's It's worth mentioning, I've been pretty good about get taking out all these enemies very uh silently, but Boy, oh boy, are these enemies a hell of a lot more involved in combat as they actually have tactical capabilities. It's the unknown, and he dealt. Send the replacement guard for the area. Mooch. Okay. Snake, there's another set of infrared sensors in place. If you touch that, the explosives will detonate and that ship will be pulverized. I'm not in the mood to go sleep with the fishes, but there are too many sensors. Looks like I'll have to find another way. No need to worry. There's a way through. Take a close look. Do you see the thing with blinking green lights right next to the explosives? That's the control unit for the sensors. Destroy that and the sensors stop functioning. You can't get in close enough to touch it, so you'll have to shoot it out. But the M9's knockout rounds won't work. The USP you picked up should do the trick. Use that gun. on your tippy toes. Checkpoint passed. 
All non-essential personnel report to the holds in ten minutes' time for the scheduled briefing session with the Commandant. You are ordered to continue manning your posts until that time. distance that they can see and it gets even longer in uh, higher difficulties and we're about to have kind of a mini boss fight Sternach. Right. The lift is also under our control. We're on the foredeck, about to descend to the holds. Sir, the Marine Commander has started his speech already. We will complete the preparations before the end of the speech. All communications to the holds have been severed. No one is aware of our presence. Let no one down into the holds until we are out. Yes, sir. We will secure your exit with our lives if necessary. Yes, sir. My daughter, keep her safe. Yes, sir. So combat isn't as complicated here as it usually is. As they only have a certain alert, one alert level. That's okay, I got thermal. about the PlayStation controller better. Finer controls, all the buttons. All the buttons are uh, analog.
Who's there? Oh, Shalashaska. Why are you here? We thought you were with the Colonel. What the? What the hell is he planning? How does he have both of his hands? The Colonel will be joining you soon, comrade. Snake, are you in yet? Have you made it to the holds? It's taking longer than I expected. We've already passed the Verrazano Bridge. All right, we'll use another recovery point. They may be planning to change course. What? The exits to the deck are all sealed. What are they planning? If they get Metal Gear, we're going right off the fringe. You're all familiar with the Shadow Moses. The men down here are definitely Marines. The current state of nuclear... If the deck is sealed off, they have no way of knowing that the ship's been taken over. I'm not interested in fighting these guys. The weapons won't do me much good here. Can you see Metal Gear? No. I'll have to go around to the bow. They have some serious defenses here. I doubt the recent arrivals want to blast their way through the Marines either. Wonder where they're headed? I don't know. Not the beach, that's for sure. Okay, Snake. Let's go over this one more time. Use this camera to get photographic evidence of the Metal Gear prototype. Now do your thing and take pictures that speak louder than the government's plausible denials. We need four shots. Metal Gear from the front, front right, and front left, and a close-up of the Marine Corps marking. Marking? There should be a Marine's insignia on the body of Metal Gear. Just let someone try explaining away a clear shot of that. All right. There's actually one little thing. Just spit it out. I'm used to things going wrong. It looks like someone's monitoring our transmission. Who? I don't have a clue. All they're doing is watching. It would creep me out less if they tried to interfere with our communications. Could it have something to do with that cipher we saw? Maybe. I've switched the encryption protocol for our burst transmission for now. What I want to do is use a different method for sending these photos, just in case. Instead of using the codec? Exactly. There's a workstation in the southeast corner of the block where Metal Gear is housed. I've made arrangements so that you can send the pictures from the machine. Arrangements? <laughs> I hitched a ride on Link 16 into U.S. military's proprietary network. Managed to get into that workstation and uh, overrun a part of the system Otacon, software you're such like a hacker. remote install a little app I wrote. Why bother with anything that complicated? No, it's pretty simple, really. Look, all you have to do is stand in front of the machine and push the action button. The app will automatically launch and download the image data from the camera, split the files, and encrypt them individually. The data packets can then masquerade as... Okay, okay. So all I have to do is push the action button in front of the computer once I have the pictures, right? Well, sure, if you put it that way. And one more thing. The Commandant's already begun his speech, but you need to get the pictures before he's done talking. Otherwise, they'll spot you, okay? How much time do I have? I hacked into his personal files and took a look at the text of that speech. I'd say you have seven more minutes. Longer if he throws in a joke or two. A seven-minute time limit, huh? Remember, Snake, just the photos, okay? With these kinds of odds, I won't be making any sudden moves. But that doesn't mean we can just let Metal Gear be hijacked. Okay, okay, but first the photos. All right, we'll deal with the rest when we get there. Stay low. 
At the moment, every industrialized nation on the globe knows the specifications for metal gear. Worse yet, so do a number of rogue states. They are all working on deploying their own metal gear force to compete with the U.S.'s nuclear strike capability. The world is about to see a swarm of these metal gear derivatives. We initiated development of Metal Gear Ray as a countermeasure to these fire and weapon uh -oh. <laughs> Well, that's uncomfortable. I had to do it once. <laughs> Snake, respond! Snake! Snake! At the moment, every industrialized nation on the globe knows the specifications for Metal Gear. Worse yet, so do a number of rogue states. They are all working on deploying their own Metal Gear force to compete with the U.S.'s nuclear strike capability. The world is about to see a swarm of these Metal Gear derivatives. We initiated development of Metal Gear Ray as a countermeasure to these pirated weapons forces. The only thing that can stand up to a Metal Gear is, of course, another Metal Gear. Freeze. <gasps> With Ray, the hundreds if not thousands of Metal Gears that exist all over the world Ray. are no longer a threat. The blind rush to nuclear proliferation will be contained, <gasps> and it will be the Marine Corps and our Ray that will accomplish this. This weapon will render all other Metal Gears obsolete. Nations building up their own Metal Gear force would think that floor was gonna. The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role <laughs> in military affairs. Oh shoot, Some that's blocking the off the side. Aircraft carriers will be reduced by the completion of raids. The opposition from the Navy is an undeniable fact. There is a lot of pressure from Navy brass, especially those with submarine and air background. Not to mention interference from a major player. But this project is vital to the Marine Corps. The enemy is sometimes closer to home than you think, gentlemen. Ah! Oh. That, that was not intended. <laughs> Snake, respond! Snake! Snake! The shift in the balance of power will mean a new world order. And we, the Marine Corps, will play a central role in its military affairs. Some say that the strategic importance of aircraft carriers will be reduced by the completion of Ray. The opposition from the Navy is an undeniable fact. There is a lot of pressure from Navy brass, especially those with submarine and air background. Not to mention interference from a major player. But this project is vital to the Marine Corps. The enemy is sometimes closer to home than you think, gentlemen. You're all familiar with the Shadow Moses incident during the Sears administration. The current state of nuclear proliferation is a direct result of that event. devoted to Metal Gear development, but it cannot be more different in nature. In the navies, theirs is a program that will add fuel to the uncontrolled fire of nuclear proliferation. It is a fact that players in favor of such a policy are attempting to derail our own raid project. But I promise you that they will not succeed. The 
It must be tense. Let's do a little stretching, shall we? Right. Left. Front. Right. Up. Getting back to the topic at hand. I have a daughter. And it is my greatest wish never to have her or her children experience the horror of nuclear war. As a father, I want to leave a better world for the future generation. As a soldier, I know that is my duty. Metal Gear Ray is amphibious. Unlike the Army's Rex, it can cruise deep underwater. Good. Move in undetected and make its landing on any shoreline. Alright, I think those are the, qu the pictures. You can also take pictures of other things in the game, and uh, Otacon will comment in funny ways. Like if you take pictures of uh, some of the FHM photos in the game, <laughs> he'll comment, you know, I'm going to keep this. So he's trying to log in as Scott, which is the name of the guy. Looks like he succeeded. So, any codec moments from you, Snake? The first image is... Okay, this works. It's a great front view. What's next? You're a pretty good photographer. We can definitely use this left shot. And the next one is... This is great. The Marines lettering shows up really well. The last one is... Okay, that's good. The shot from the right is in the bag. We, the Marines, will lead the charge into a new world order with Metal Gear Ray. That is all. Dismissed. Excellent speech, my friend. Who the? Gift of the silver tongue. They say it's the mark of a good officer. And of a liar. Americans are too in love with the sound of their own voice to speak the truth. Identify yourself. I am Shalashaska. Also called... Revolver Ocelot. What do you want? This machine will be quite useful. What are you planning to do? Steal this thing? Steal? No, no, I'm taking it back. Taking it back? Timed. Gerlukovich. Nobody move. Understood. 
This ship now carries enough Simtex on its key structural points to blow it out of the water at the touch of this button. That's right. No one has to die needlessly. Streets. I was raised in Znezinsk, formerly known as Chelyabinsk 70, the nuclear research outpost. What are you talking about? After the Cold War ended, my home was bought out by the Americans. Is there a point to this sad story? Not you would understand. Land, friends, dignity, all sold to the highest bidder, the United States of America. Even the technology that gave birth to these weapons is Russian, developed by us. He's right. What do you intend to do? Russia will rise again. And Ray is the key. I regret to inform you that I have no intention of selling Metal Gear. As I said, I came to take it back. Oh. Yes, returned to the Patriots. The Lale Lule Low. How's that possible? Awesome. Lale Lule Low. You we don't find out the story about out. that for a long time. <laughs> I was never in your employ, Kalukovich. Are you still in league with Solidus? No hard feelings, Colonel. Mother Russia can rot for all I care. Since when, Ocelot? When did you turn? I'm glad you noticed, comrade. I abandoned her during the Cold War. She's been a double agent for a long time, apparently. Metal Gear only has room for one! Gulukovic, you and your daughter will die here. Damn you! <laughs> Looks like you were long overdue for retirement. I trust. Oh. Holy cow. Well, now we know why he's a revolver ocelot. He didn't really get much chance to show his uh, skills, you know, in Metal Gear Solid 1. Considering he got his hand cut off by the cyborg ninja. How does he have two hands? <laughs> Show's over. If you wish to live, I suggest you run now. This ship is still in the lower New York Harbor. You may yet make it to shore if you swim for your life.
they can't hit him. There's a story behind that, too. Ocelot! Got Liquid's arm? It's been a while, brother. Who are you? You know who I am. Liquid? Not so young anymore, eh, Snake? You're drowning in time. I know what it's like, brother. No wonder Naomi passed you over for the Fox Dive program. <laughs> Get out, out of, of my, my mind, mind, Liquid! <laughs> the price of physical prodigy. Few more years and you'll be another dead clone of the old man. Our raw materials are vintage, brother. Big Boss was in his late 50s when they created his copies. But I, I live on through this arm! Liquid arm. Those graphic thing an arm on someone graft the personality on them too, I wonder. You don't have what it takes after all! I am curious what the story is about that. You're going down, Snake, with this tanker! <laughs>
Pause a lot, I guess, is back in control of the body. Discussed. Yes, I have photographic evidence of Snake on the scene. The cipher was most useful. I look forward to tomorrow morning's news flash. I would say the Marine Corps' plans are on indefinite hold. Yes, of course, Mr. President. I think that's going to wrap us out for this episode. So, things seem pretty dire. In the next episode, we're going to continue along and see where that takes us. Hopefully, Snake survived. But until then, thank you everybody for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.